Picking winners and losers in the pandemic economy. That's an accusation from a longtime farm family who's suing Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir over his COVID-19 executive orders. WHAS 11 political editor Chris Williams has details from Scott County. Evans family has been farming here in Scott County for more than 90 years. In the early 2000s, they did what many small family farms did. They went to an agritourism model. Now they fear their legacy is in danger because of pandemic rules put in place by Governor Andy Bashir. I have a 14 year old daughter. I want this farm to be here for her to take over. So um, that's that's solely our, our purpose. Jenny Evans insists a lawsuit challenging Governor Bashir's limitations on how many people can attend events at her farm is not political. She's frustrated with limitations to reopening her wedding venue and that the 96,000 square foot play center, an area big enough to build 20 residential homes, was only allowed 10 people at a time until today when that changed to 50. They hired more workers to clean every surface, required face masks and put in place rules to social distance. But Jenny claims her local health department refused their reopening plan and was confused about what category the business fell under. The governor's office, she says, never responded. It's often cited, we're all in this together. Let's work together. And Commissioner Ryan Quarles stood with her filing the suit he says focuses on process and the rule of law during a pandemic. We asked the governor's office for comment. They sent this statement citing increased COVID-19 cases in other states, accusing the Evans and commissioner of trying to eliminate public health requirements and quote, if the parties here won and the virus spread because the facility was not following proper guidance, it could threaten the reopening of our economy and public schools. They want to comply, but they also want to do it safely. And they just want to know what the rules are and have the opportunity to speak up. There's no I in Team Kentucky. We have to do this together. You know, we didn't want it to come off political. It's not. Um, it's, it's just what we have to do to try to save our farm. And I can't sit by and, and watch it, you know, just dwindle away. The Evans family and Commissioner Quarles hope that any victory in court would prevent a situation like this from happening again. If God forbid we were to see a spike in COVID-19 cases. In Scott County, Chris Williams, WHAS 11 News.